Good afternoon everybody, how we are doing? It is Wednesday and uh, yeah, let's sit back and relax and get in with this whatever I'm about to talk about. So, I'm just back home, I've been home for about an hour now. Um, so this morning I had a mad rush about to take my son somewhere um, and at the same point I found myself a laptop but if you if you're not from UK and you're around the world, you probably not know a place called Cash Converters. It's where you can go and sell some products, products. I mean, electricals or whatever you have, and you need cash. I won't, I wasn't thinking. I took some for something, but I saw a laptop and I thought, oh, that's not bad. And I'm not ashamed to buy second hand. You know what I mean? It's just as good as a new one. So. My son put a deposit down for me and oh, oh doggies so my son put a deposit 20 pound deposit down so i've only got 60 quid to pay next week so that i'm gonna get a, a year's guarantee with it so that's not so bad and yeah so that's it i can start my nursing course next week when i've got it but oh i had to run the mad dash home and the traffic because my city centre where I am, it's all changed into one way system and it takes you blooming ages to get out of the town. And there's certain ways that you can't go, it's only buses. So anyhow, I got back quickly, um, got Ronnie in the cat carrier. Sorry, I can see my finger in the camera. Um, quickly got Ronnie in the cat carrier and took him up to the vets. Now, he's okay though, thank goodness. It's only a checkup, but he's on antibiotics. Even just because his tail is multicolored right now, it's like red, black. I won't even get into because it, it turns my stomach. It looks infected. I think it's infected because he's been given antibiotics. But I think they're giving him antibiotics because he's been licking his tail, and obviously the infection is probably going in his system. So he's been given a corn. He's not happy about that. He's sulking in the cage because he's still on bed rest. Um, yes, Millie, you can smell another dog because I was at the vets and yeah, a dog brushed past it, pie that pie me, I can't speak. So, unfortunately, he's got to go back on Tuesday coming and getting his tail amputated. The poor thing, um, I feel really bad for him, but it's dead, isn't this? this no purpose for him to have a tail. The only thing it's gonna cost. Oh. And I think they wanted to do it today, but because I didn't have the funds, I didn't have the funds to pay for his antibiotics, but they'll let me pay in it next week because I'm, I'm going back anyway, so this PDSA I think they're okay. Um but I've got felt because Millie's a f the first person on dog on there, the the second animal is full price. Um, so he's getting his, his tail amputated on Tuesday coming and then I've got on the Tuesday coming I've got to then take him at half past eight in the morning drop him off come back pick Sutty, Theo and Bella up because they're getting microchipped on Tuesday drop them off back home to come back into town to pick up my laptop and then hopefully my son can do all the necessary things because I am not good with IT, put it, you know, you could probably tell with some of my videos, I'm not probably not that, I don't know, I'm babbling on now. So that's my plans for Tuesday next week, <laughs> I'm all day, um, but yeah, so, I mean, it's an okay laptop, it's second hand, but you can't complain, can you, sometimes, you tell up to there. I'm stopping it as a good old life because I can't afford a brand new one right now um, with what's happening in the Colton household. Everything and everything is going wrong. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm just about to do some schoolwork with Olivia. Well, she's going to do schoolwork and I'm going to monitor. <laughs> I've got it all right. I ain't even got it ready, to be honest, because I was in a mad rush this morning. Uh, so I'm going to go and do that, tell her what to do. And then she can have a, a reading session. She can read a, some reading, and then we can go. She can go and take the dog out. Um, I'm trying to follow her timetable that she had at school 
but for some reason I have put it a uh, diary down and cannot find it so yeah I need to have a good old look and I need a cup of tea as well so mm hmm well I was gonna say something oh yeah um so I'm gonna explain this more in another video and I don't know I've just feel, I've talked to my son earlier about it and I said you know I still I feel like I need to get a second opinion for this autism thing because I know I'm 45 now and people are like oh you're a bit too old for all that you don't need to yeah but I feel different this I don't you know people go you trust your body and trust your mind well I feel different my head's maybe I can get some answers maybe I am a autistic or I may be ADHD but I need to know just because coming to do this course and maybe uni I'm going to need to know that because if there's some issues then I might be able to get some support in place because yeah I do feel different I know I'm an adult and I've got an adult's body but I feel like inside you know, I've got a different brain like a childlike brain sometimes I react to things weird and I don't like socialization my food if it's touching another food it like freaks me out the list goes on so that's gonna be another video in itself to talk about it properly and I spoke to someone as well that is neuro da, 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 that word that tests people for autism and she said that I sound like I am on the spectrum but I, you know I just need to go get a second opinion so yeah, <clears throat> I'm going to sage the, uh, my, car, my tarot cards as well this afternoon just, and the only thing is it's a pain in the backside but it has to be done, you've got to do it individually, it's like oh my lad I'm going to be here all day, but yeah, and it's just in case it's got some negative energy from you know the surroundings, especially when you do a reading and if you use your cards it can obviously you need to sage, but oh, yeah i'm gonna go guys because i need a cup of tea i just have egg butter and i need to go wake my son up um because he's not feeling too great and we need to have a chat so that being said guys let me know what you're doing today and let me know if you're fe feeling as daft as i am because i don't know what what's come over me i feel a bit in a goofy mood um daft mood whatever you want to cool it I feel like I'm ready to tell crack a few jokes um but I am pretty tired at the same time so yeah it may be a nap is in order so fibro warriors how are you doing today before I go because I've not mentioned fibro for a while um I am in pain just because my face go you you're like you don't look like you're in pain believe me I am and this arm <laughs> especially uh is killing me because i feel like i sprained my wrist but like further up my arm type of feeling but I'm, I'm going to take some pain relief and hopefully that'll ease it off i need a booking with the doctors and get some blood done because my mum's like it might be a thyroid but yeah she's probably right because last time i had them done all borderline so anyway i'm gonna go because the kettle is calling my name. Coffee. Titi. <laughs> Thanks again for watching, guys. I'm sorry if I'm, uh, I'm just away with fairies. Um, but yeah, let me know what you're doing for today, and I'll catch up with you in your vid, in your video, in my next video. And in, hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe button, and that notification bell. And I'll see you soon. See you later, alligators.